So today we're going to be making pancakes. And I want to make it look like crepe, so we're going to have to make it thinner. And so now, let's proceed to the frosting. In a bowl of stand mixer, fitted with whisk, add your one cup of unsalted butter and whisk it all together. It has to be softened so it is easier to whisk. Then you can now add your condensed milk and whisk it on high speed for 7 minutes. It should look whipped and lightened in color. After that, add 8 oz of softened cream cheese. Continue beating for 3 minutes or until no longer lumpy. Add 2 teaspoons of vanilla extract and whisk until incorporated and smooth. Some tiny lumps are okay and will not be noticeable in the cake, so it's fine. Now let's move on to making the batter of the pancake. We will need 2 medium-sized eggs. Then add 4 tablespoons of cooking oil. Then add one and a half cup of water into your mixture. Now you can finally add your powdered ingredients from the box that we used for pancakes. Mix that all together until it becomes smooth and light colored. And you should get rid of the lumps by pressing into the bowl or something. <laughs> now let's go in with cooking the pancake. So I separated them into small bowls so I can measure how much I want it to be, like how big I want it to be. So. Once there are like bubbles on top of the pancake, you can like flip it over and then wait for a little bit of minutes and then you can now serve it. So here is our frosting and now we are going to start and fill in the, the pancake. Here I have my dog Luna watching me. I'm teaching her how to make, apparently she is so smart. The second layer. So we got our first layer in. Right there. This part is really very easy and you can really do it. Like anyone can do it. Now we're gonna put in the third layer. And grab the last layer. Now our frosted banana pancake is done. Let's do the taste test. So let's slice into this 